what's up everybody this is david jagna with the jagnauts and tonight we are going to be playing some demon souls this is the demon souls remake that just released on ps5 from blue point games it is a remake of the classic ps3 uh, demon souls uh, from from software obviously the precursor to the dark souls series uh, the game that kind of kicked off the entire obsession with souls like games uh the, the one of the forefathers i guess you could say uh this is a brand new remake that just came out last month it, or i'm sorry last week uh for ps5 it's an exclusive for ps5 and we're gonna be playing it and doing some first and impressions we're gonna be playing it and doing some first and impressions we're gonna be playing it. whoop my bad uh doing some first impressions here tonight i have not played the remake before I played the original a little bit, not a ton, but I did play it a little bit. Uh, so I won't be going in totally blind, but pretty, pretty close to blind here. I'm just setting up a few last things on my end. I'm going to share the stream over on my Twitter. If you're unaware, I do stream on Facebook, Twitch, and YouTube all simultaneously. So. You can check it out on any of those platforms, wherever you are most comfortable. Facebook is my primary platform, but I do stream everywhere else as well. All right, oh I God. think I'm just about ready to get going. Bell, what's up? Think of the like. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Let me get the stream shared on Facebook into a few places real quick. What have I got? Thank you for sharing it over on your Queen Bee Gaming page, and thank you for the like there as well. How are you doing tonight? My God, that's loud. Good Lord. I need to fix that. Oh, that is hurting my ears. Okay, I think it should be fixed now. <laughs> I've got a new alert set up for shares and I was not prepared for how loud that was. Oh my God. Okay, I think it's much better now. All right, let me put a little poll on the Facebook. There we go, looking good. Eating dinner, nice, what's for dinner tonight? We had some chicken with uh, zucchini noodles tonight. Valerie made dinner, it was quite delicious. All right, that looks good, that looks good. I think all this is looking good on my end. Let's go ahead and push it out to Twitter, let people know. And then let me hit a couple groups real quick here on Facebook, and then we're gonna be ready to get going. Spaghetti, nice, nice. Can't go wrong with spaghetti. You really can't. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. That is still way too loud. What on earth is happening? Come on. 
Okay, the volume should be much lower now. I don't know what's going on with that sound. <laughs> God. So incredibly loud. All right, there we go. I've got it shared around to a few places and I think we're basically ready to get going. There we go. That volume is much better. I might even go a little bit lower. All right, about to hit the play button for the first time on this one. I played the game a little bit back on uh, PS3. It's actually the reason I bought a PS3 and I really loved it. I just never finished it. Uh, so we're gonna see we're, we're gonna see how this one shapes up. I remember the first world quite a bit because I spent a lot of time there. Um, but I never, like I said, I never finished this game on PS3. So um, a lot of it's gonna be very fresh and new. All right. I'm trying a slightly different camera angle. I'm also rocking my Jaggernaut T-shirt, as you can see. Available in our merch store, link in the description of the Facebook video. You can also get a discount by being a Patreon supporter. All right, it is now time with the power of the DualSense controller. Uh, yeah, Bell, my shirt fits okay. The one that Valerie got is a little big. I don't remember what size we ordered, um, but they they do fit. Whenever we get our Australia box, we're going to wear those whenever we do the, the unboxing on the stream for the goodies that you sent over. We'll be sending ours very soon. We're still trying to round up a few of the, of the final snacks that we want to send. Some of them are hard to find. All right, I think that should be pretty good. All righty. Yeah, that makes sense, Bill. I know that kind of stuff takes a while. All right, playing in English. I don't have HDR on this TV, but everything looks perfectly fine. I'm, I'm just gonna leave it the way it is, the default settings. Uh, put subtitles on. Ooh. <laughs> You're on YouTube now too. Oh my gosh, this song. This looks incredible. The visuals are just insane. <laughs> Hi, Bell. You stopped by all three. Look, would you look at that? Oh, 
would you look at the oh my god I mean there's no way the stream is doing this justice stuck at 1080p but seeing this on a 4k display oh my gosh Ooh, I am ready all right what do we need to adjust any other yeah, let's go performance. I think I'd prefer performance as my visual mode. Motion blur, we'll turn that down. I don't mind having it on just a tiny bit, but I don't like it up very high. Uh, let's just go with everything everything else the way it is. Okay. How's everyone doing tonight? Has uh, anyone in the chat played this yet? I played the uh, original a little bit on PS3, but I never finished it. I'm gonna go body type B. Oh man, even the character creator alone is just incredible compared to, I mean, especially compared to the first one, but compared to most games. Oh yeah, yeah, of course, Bell. Yeah, I hope everything's okay with her arm. Um, we're just, I'm gonna be predictable. Hey Christian, thank you very much for following over on Facebook. I appreciate that. How are you doing? We're just gonna name on the Jaggernaut. Class. Let's see here. Sturdy armor, adept at close combat. That seems like a good fit. 14 strength starting. Well, it definitely says you followed, Christian. I'm sorry if there was some kind of error. If you hit the like button, that's the same as following on Facebook. It's very similar. Barbarian has more strength. Temple Knight. That's a more complex one, I think. Mm. Uh, that's not what it does, Christian. Not at all. I have no problem removing you, though. It doesn't automatically make you do that. Um, let's see. Starting gift. I'm not even sure what the recommended starting gift is. Okay, Bell, that makes sense. Raises, uh, poises, throwing soul remains. Um, the guiding light could be useful. Well, I'm sorry, Christian. You're more than welcome to unfollow. It's weird that it auto followed. I've never heard of that ever happening before. Um, let's go with that. That sounds like it could be pretty useful. Okay, foundation. Animation style, that's interesting that you get to pick an animation style. Well, that is really bizarre, Christian. I'm s that's very strange. I've literally never heard of that ever happening before. I'm gonna go style B. Uh, oh. I like that one. Let's go appearance. I mean, as far as presets go, <laughs> that's pretty spot on. I don't think I really need to make too many tweaks. That's basically what I look like. Uh, let's see, hair options maybe a little bit. 
Yeah, that's weird, Christian. I'm sorry, man. That's a very weird uh, thing for it to automatically do. I mean, that's... It's not going to get a whole lot more accurate than that. That's... This is pretty, pretty dang close. Yeah, thank you, Bill. I appreciate you stopping by. I'll probably be, um, be on for a little while. I really do want to spend some time with this game, finally. I've been putting it off forever. I mean, well, forever. Ever since I got access to it. Okay, what's the best way to make brown here? There we go. Yeah, I'm not going to spend much time in the creator, Christian. Don't worry. I think I'm I'm pretty much I'm close to being done already. I mean, there's like I said, it's weird. Like I mean, it's not exactly the same, but that's it's pretty close. I'm not the kind of person that's going to sit here and tweak every single thing possible. Whoa, you can make your eyes glow? I'm totally doing glowing eyes. Of course I'm gonna do glowing eyes. Who wouldn't want glowing eyes if you had the choice? There. Sure. Looks good. Um, I think we're good to go. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. God. Boletaria was cut off. It's hard to imagine this is actually gameplay. And those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog. Yeah, this is a pretty hard game, Christian. But it's it's definitely fun, even if you know it takes a while to play, and even if you never finish it, it's. It's still a fun game, I think. I never finished it on PS3. I like all the lore, how they actually do a good job of establishing things. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fisher to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. The awe of the twin fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbain. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astria with her night girl Vinland. And Sage Frake the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. A cuphead's a very hard game. Will eventually swallow all I don't know how experienced you are with RPGs, but if you can beat Cuphead, I would imagine this game is within the realm of possibility for you. The lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or it's really just trial and error. Found a new slave. All right. Here we go. Uh, 
Oh wow. I can feel every step in the dual sense controller. It's crazy. I shall guide you to the fissure. Wow. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. So the world might be mended, I think is what she says. What is this? Is this is this another player with me? Oh my god, this I think this might be the most visually impressive game I've ever played in my life. Look at the water. Oh my god, the lighting. This is incredible. Oh, someone's left a message for me. Okay, this is one of the game messages that's built into the game there. Standard attack. Okay. There we go. That's not so hard. I think I just... <laughs> I beat Demon Souls, everybody. Oh. Look at how smooth it is. This is incredible. This is fantastic. Okay, that's how you sprint. But can we just look at look at the lighting here? I mean, you can see it. Like, oh, that's so crazy. And look at the water as you walk in the puddles. Each ripple, that is nuts. Yep, block. Got him. Good job. Good job, team. Well, I hope you can get a PS5, Christian. It's an amazing system. Oh, okay. I've already taken damage. That's all right. That's all right. It was. An, I wanted to test out to make sure I could take damage. You know, I was. I was making sure the game wasn't bugged. That's what that was. You, I'm sure you'll get a PS5 eventually. I would. I would try to hold out until you can get one at a normal price, though. Wow. Oh my gosh. Crescent moon grass. I, I can't get over the lighting. It's just amazing. Oh, wait. What was this? Use item, switch item. Okay. Half moon grass, noble lotus. Okay. Vault over railings, okay. Am I just supposed to jump down there? Is that what it's telling me to do right now? Do I trust that? Okay, yes I do, okay. Oh, I remember this area from the trailers. Minecraft ray tracing in VR would be crazy. I cannot get over this water. I honestly think this is the best looking water I've ever seen in a game. It even beats Sea of Thieves. This is just incredible. Oh my god. I got I was too busy looking at the water.
Come at me. Come at me. Okay, heavy attack kills him. There we go. Okay, how is that tree just on fire, but it's not burned down? Okay. Let's make sure we explore this area. Okay, if you're in the chat right now, I want to say hello and thank you for stopping by. If you don't mind hitting that like button on Facebook, that would be greatly appreciated. If you want to follow the page, you can totally do that. I stream almost every night here on Facebook. I play a wide variety of games, including RPGs, shooters, battle royale games, retro games, all kinds of stuff. I'm also running a giveaway right now. If you sign up for my Patreon before the month is over, you can uh, enter for a chance to win a, a copy of Godfall on PS5 or PC or 12 months of Xbox Game Pass Ultimate or a copy of Yakuza for Xbox. It's your choice. It's the winner's choice, I should say. Oh, this is like an actual person. There we go. Okay, circle is dodged. That's right. Okay. Oh, okay. You got a L2 is parry. That's right. For some reason, I was thinking you just had to time your block, but you have to parry is a different action. Oh, okay. Let's try it again. Nope. There we go. Oh, that was nasty. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Oh, big boy. Look at that. Uh, the best way to describe it is uh, it feel like, you know how usually whenever a controller vibrates, just the whole thing shakes or kind of the whole thing rumbles in your hand. The dual sense, it feels like there's like a thousand different points of vibration spread throughout the whole controller. So depending on what's happening in the game, it'll trigger different areas of the controller to vibrate in your hand. So it kind of simulates the feeling of something in your hand or something moving around. Um, so like one example is like right now I'm not feeling anything because I'm just walking. But um, like let me try hitting this. Yeah, so whenever I strike this wall, I can feel it like the vibration sort of ripples up my right hand. And then, like, whenever I do this, the shield bash, I can feel it ripple on my left hand. And so it kind of simulates the feeling that the character has. And, like, another example is in Astro Playroom. There's a level where it's raining. I can feel the droplets of rain inside the controller. And, like, in a Dirt 5, it's a racing game. The actual triggers will be, like, the tension on the triggers makes it harder to push the gas or to push the brake, depending on you know what the car is doing. Uh, it pushes back against your finger. It's a little dagger. Okay. All right. Yeah, it's, it's hard to describe Christian, but once you experience it, it's pretty amazing. Like, it's honestly a big enough deal to me that if a game is available on Series X, PC, and PS5, like if it's a multi-platform game, most of the time now, I'm probably going to pick the PS5 version just because of the controller. And performance-wise, it's great. I mean, I haven't had any problems. Can I... Oh, why can't I get this axe? That sucks. Why is the axe there if I can't get it? 
If anyone else has any questions about the PS5, let me know. I'm happy to answer them. Um, in case you are unfamiliar, I am a game journalist, so I write about games as my job full time. Um, I didn't end up getting a review lined up for Demon Souls, so that's why I'm just now playing it. But I did review Astro's Playroom and Sackboy and Call of Duty Cold War Zombies and a bunch of other stuff. I, I reviewed Godfall as well. Um, no, Godfall doesn't really use the dual sense very much um, compared to other games. I mean, you'll feel the like vibration and stuff, but um, compared to a lot of other stuff, it doesn't really utilize it super well. It doesn't do anything that impressive. It's just more dynamic vibration. Whoops. The best examples I've experienced are Call of Duty Cold War, um, well, Black Ops Cold War, Dirt 5, and Astro's Playroom are the three best ones for the experiencing what the DualSense can do so far to me. Call of Duty is crazy because it's like every gun feels different in your hand. Like, it's, it's nuts. There we go. Getting the timing right on those parries is so interesting. Like, it's you have to be so precise with it. There's very little room for error there, which is understandable. I mean, that's the whole point of these games, right? I cannot get over the graphics. This game just looks so phenomenal. You can actually beat this boss. It is possible. See one hit, I'm dead. Yeah, I don't think, um, I don't know, Cold War isn't that great. I haven't played the campaign yet, I've only played multiplayer and zombies. It's okay. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. So you're supposed to lose to that boss. So the world might be mended. Yeah, so the world might be mended. Soul of the lost. Withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Thank you for stopping by, Christian. Like I said, I stream almost every night, so maybe I'll see you around another time. The Nexus has imprisoned your soul. By capturing demon souls, you can reclaim your corporeal body. This game is just incredible. I can't get over how good it looks. The visuals are blowing my mind. If I remember correctly, this is the first world, right? This one right here? I can't remember. Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls. Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero. <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the Archstones. Now go. 
That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed proletarian. All right. I don't think I have much of anything right now, right? Yeah, obviously soul level four. I only have 188 souls. I don't think I can level up or anything yet. Oh yeah, I forgot the world tendency was a, a thing. I feel like the UI is different. I think they changed the uh, the pause menu inventory and stuff. This looks different. Mm, you knew here. Are you here for my services? The name's this... Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the trade with your souls. Okay. Let's see, can I purchase any new stuff from this guy? No, I don't have anywhere near enough souls to buy things. Oh wait, I could buy some grass, right? Sure. I'll buy one more of those. I have a feeling that will come in handy. Okay, what is square? Is that use I think square is use item? When the scouts came, I didn't know what hit me. My wife, but I okay. would be happy to wait. Oh, okay, so I can put things in storage. I'm imagining that would uh, be useful. Okay, I don't need those souls there. Rest assured, your goods are safe and sound with me. Okay, so what does this do exactly? It's used as a guide. I probably shouldn't have taken that. It sounds like it was a kind of a bad move. Visions of beginners. Sure. Welcome. Thank you. I'll hit the like button on that one. I don't think there's anything else for me to do here, so I think I'm going to go ahead and go back in the first world. Archstone of the Covetous King. Let's see what the load time's like. Yeah, Boletarian Palace. This is the first one. go that is a short load screen that was fantastic oh my god How many people is in its mouth? That was terrifying. Wow, okay. Well, I can see other people fighting. Welcome. Georges, thank you very much for the follow. Over on Facebook, I appreciate it very, very much. Um, let's see here. All right. Notice how my health is uh, chopped in half because I was dead. Okay, here. So this is a soul stain. So this will show you how someone died. This is an actual person. This is exactly what happened to them when they died. So they must have lured an enemy back here and they were fighting them. Oh, hold up, hold up. Good old classic check behind the uh, spawn point. Best of luck. Yeah, thank you. Ah, okay. Now see, the tricky thing about this area here is I remember there are enemies behind those wooden uh, cover points. So you gotta keep your eyes peeled. Yep, right there. Ah. There we 
go. Hey, I got a cheap little shield here. Maybe I should use that instead of wasting my good shield right now. Probably makes more sense, right? I'm guessing this is locked, probably. Yeah, I don't think I can open that right now. Oh! Nice, got an unknown warrior soul. You can redeem those for souls back at the Nexus. Ooh, that's nasty. Try shield, okay. There we go. Aaron, hey, what's up, man? Thank you for the like and the share. Hope you enjoy my uh, my new share alert that I set up. Decided to update that one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god. No, 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 no. There we go. Give me that. That wasn't so bad. Okay, if I remember correctly... Hey, it's all good, Aaron. I totally understand. How are you doing tonight? Yeah, I can't open this. Beware of cowards ahead, okay. So an ambush of some kind, yep. Okay, let's draw everyone away from there. Nope, that was bad. Here we go, finally got him. Yep, that is death right there. <laughs> if you jump down from here. I remember that pit. I fell for that one. And see, this is where the blood stains can come in handy as you click on one, right? And you're like, oh, I wonder how they died. Let's see, what happened? Um, oh, okay, that was a normal death. What about this person? How do they die? I don't know, that one's not working. Avoid ghosts. Okay. I'll do my best. Oh, yep, I heard him. I heard him on the right. You got that 3D audio kicking in. There we 
go. Healed up a little bit. Aware of enemies ahead. Thank you. I think this one already. Oh, nope. There he is. So what about you, Aaron? Have you ever played uh, Demon Souls back on PS3? Did you ever play it? Did you get a PS5 or a Series X yet? I know you said you were getting both eventually. Time for rolling. <laughs> oh, I got five fire bombs. That's what's up. Okay. I can imagine that will be useful. There's a person right there. I'm going to switch to my good shield. I tried to do a parry and it did not work out very well. Oh, no new system yet? That's a bummer. Hopefully you can get one soon. Look for a weapon. Uh. <clears throat> Ooh, I got another mail breaker. Yeah, this game's really amazing so far. It's probably hard to tell in the stream because it's a 1080p stream, so you guys aren't seeing the full quality here, but playing on my 4K TV right now, like, I honestly think this might be the best looking game I've ever played. It's just so good looking. I think there's a boulder here. Oh no, it's fire bombs. Okay. I think he's on the platform up there. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Ooh, that was a lucky hit. Um, how do we get to this thing? I don't know how I get that item. Oh, come on. God, even the rope. Would you look at that? Like... Ooh. Oh, man. Welcome. Patek, thank you very much for the follow on Facebook. I appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. Let's see. How? Oh, 
I want to get that. I don't know how to get in there. She is severely, oh severely disappointed with the game. Why is she disappointed, Aaron? Edmar, thank you very much for the like. I appreciate it. How are you doing tonight? Okay, what does this say? Ignore. Okay. Beware of barrels. That's good advice. Avoid traps. Okay. Is this where the boulder... Yeah, that's the boulder. Oh, that's how you get that item. There we go. Whoops. Ooh, I got a big sword. Here we go. I'm switching to the big sword now. <gasps> okay. Okay, if I wield it with both hands. How do I wield it with both hands? I'm not sure how to make sure I'm holding this with both hands. Do I have to put it in both slots, maybe? No. Um, let's see here. I'm not really sure. Oh, it's just triangle. That's it. <laughs> Very simple thing. Okay. So you can still block. You can still parry. Okay. I just can't block projectiles. Oh yeah, well that makes sense, Aaron. If she was expecting a little bit of planet game, then it's very, very different. It's nothing like them at all, really. It's just using Sackboy as the character. I think that's why they didn't name it Little Big Planet, because it's not a Little Big Planet game. So she probably just didn't have the right expectations. Oh my god. Ooh, okay, this sword's pretty nasty, though. Okay, let's dodge this guy. Aha! Oh, that's delicious. Single hit. Okay. Come over here, come over here. Oh my... There we go. So far, so good here. Yeah, I, I can fully understand that. Okay, that guy has a glowing face, so that's how you know. He means business. This is not your normal, everyday guy. I am... Hoping I don't die here. Oh, okay. Oh, this guy's nothing. That was easy. Just gotta make sure it doesn't hit you, that's it. 
Time for vaulting. Oh no. Uh, am I supposed to go down there? Hmm, I don't know if I trust that. What do you think? What, what does the chat think? Should I jump down there? It doesn't look too far. Maybe I won't die. But then again, I might. And I would lose all 700 of my souls. Jump down. All right, Aaron. Is there anything in here? More fire bombs. What's down here? The wear of barrels. Okay. Oh, we got a lot of enemies. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, I will gladly let them kill themselves. That's fine. Okay, let me go jump down there like you wanted, Aaron. How is the audio balance? Is audio okay? Between the game and the microphone and everything? You do, on second thought, don't know. There's no second thoughts here. I go purely based on first instinct. Look at that. I landed like an elegant, graceful spider. Congratulations. Oh, I have a crossbow now. Interesting, interesting. Let's equip that, of course. There we go, I've got 16 bolts. Nice. Yeah, I took that fall like a champ, that's right, man. Oh. <laughs> well, he was not expecting me, that's for sure. Alright, so that's what I do then. I just drop back down. Make my way back up. Cool. Easy. Hello, Hamburglar. What's up, Dylan? Don't worry, you haven't missed much. I'm still pretty early on here. Looks like there's a blue moon tonight. What's up, Jimmy? What is a blue moon? I don't know what that means. Okay, this is where I came... Okay, yeah, yeah. Down here is that staircase, right? Oh wait, what happened? Oh no, 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 I'm not ready to fight that guy. I remember that guy. No, thank you. Yeah, be wary of tough guy, that's right. I'm gonna stay very far away from him. <laughs> oh, cause he showed up. All right, playing some 76, nice. What is that new update that's coming out on the first? I haven't looked into it very much. Is that a big update for Fallout 76? All right, so we had those two guys blow up on the barrels here. Let's see what else we're dealing with. Okay, nothing fancy with this one. Oh my god. Just straight up lit me on fire, dude. Yeah, the Brotherhood of Steel DLC. Is that like a bunch of new quests or what exactly does it is it adding? Can I cut these chains? Oh, I can. I wasn't sure that would work. What have I got? Interesting. Arsalan, thank you very much for the like on Facebook. I appreciate it. 
Let me know how you're doing tonight. Oh boy. How do I, can I aim? I don't know how to aim. Are they all just committing suicide? Can you aim with the freaking crossbow? Oh my god, these guys keep doing the same thing over and over and over. New quest, new faction, NPCs, location. Okay, cool. So it's it's a pretty big update then. Is that paid or is that going to be free for everybody? A cling ring. What does that do? Well, that's pretty amazing. I have a lot more health now in soul form. How did I miss these earlier? I don't know how I missed all that. What is that ornament thing? Jade hair ornament? I don't know what that is. Huh. Well, let's see here. Old ragged robes. Why can't I wear these? I can't change my armor for some reason. I must not meet whatever the requirements are. Oh, that's cool, Dylan. Hey, Silent Heart. What's up? games are really good so far like I was saying earlier I think honestly like it's probably the best looking game I've ever played it looks so amazing and that doesn't really come through on the stream I'm sure like looking at the output you guys are watching a 1080p feed or even 720 potentially and that just is not high enough resolution <laughs> like, this game is gorgeous, but you, you can't really appreciate it fully. That starting area looked incredible. I mean, the water effects were insane. The ripples and the puddles and the droplets and it was just crazy. All right. I don't remember what's through this fog, so let's find out. Alright, Dylan says whenever he gets his PS5 next week, this and Watch Dog Legion and Spider-Man are the games you're thinking of getting. This game is, is a bit different from Dark Souls. Um, it is, it's a more linear game. It's, um, more, it's a little more segmented into different zones and levels and stuff. Okay, maybe this guy... Yeah, that's what I thought would happen. Throw another one. Come on. Throw another one. There we go. Yeah, that that's often the, the issue with Dark Souls is people tend to have no idea what they're doing, really. This game is a bit shorter. A lot of people say it's more difficult. It is a more linear game overall, but there are a lot of hidden areas and secrets still.
Oh, hey. This is a merchant. Oh, okay. That's good to know. Good day to you. Care to look over my wares? Mostly stolen, but who's telling me? All right, we got some healing items here. I can get a long sword, club, a short spear. I've already got all those armor pieces. Some more bolts might be a good idea. Maybe 10 more. I think I'm doing okay. So that stops bleeding. Can I find out how many I have? That would be very useful, but it doesn't look like it tells you. I have some fire bombs already. Thanks for that. Come back soon. Oh, I don't have any of the blue ones, actually. Let me. All right. Let me buy a couple of the blue ones. Thanks for that. It reminds me of the merchant from Resident Evil Four. See, like, look at this water. Look at the puddle. Maybe step in it. Watch. Ah, uh, that one's not. It's not large enough or deep enough. Okay, those explode. Beware of warriors ahead. Okay. Oh, oh, he didn't die. Okay, he died in there, so there's someone in there. Oh, you know what? Hold up. This could be risky, but let's see. It looks like I can jump off right here. No, that's not the case. Okay. I can go that way, or I can go this way. Oh my god. How do you aim the dang thing? I'm so confused. Is there no way to aim? Surely there's a way to aim. What are the controls? Here we go. Um, switch items, switch magic. Using magic, using bow, precision, aim. Oh. Wait, no, that's not doing anything either. Okay, I don't know. It's a lost cause. <laughs> Perry. Oh, no. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's... 
Okay, I did not expect that guy to be there. Whoops. What? Come on. There we go. Look at great view. Yeah. This actually is a nice view. Not bad, not bad. Uh, just a quick shout out to our Patreon supporters here on the Juggernauts we have. Bell B, Chris Waglin, Aaron Johnson, James Newberry, and Johnny Benuelos. Thank you to those five supporters we have in our Patreon. And just to let you know, if you do sign up for our Patreon this month before December, you'll be entered for a chance to win our giveaway. Uh, the giveaway is either a copy of Godfall for PS5 or PC, an Xbox Game Pass Ultimate 12 month subscription, or a copy of Yakuza Like a Dragon on Xbox. Winner gets to pick. Look, okay, look at this water. This is what I was talking about. Look at the water. Just watch the little subtle ripples. It's so crazy. The reflections, I cannot get over it. It's insane. Look at that. Yeah, is there an enemy up here? There is. There's a lot of enemies. Okay, yep. Jesus, that's loud. Aaron, thank you for the 100 stars. I appreciate it very much. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Ooh, that was close. That was very close. There are three, four crossbow people. Let me give you your will spin right now, Aaron, while I'm hiding. Ah, oh, it's in push-ups. All right, here we go. There you go, Aaron. Oh, 
Okay, shooting me here. And I'll dodge. Okay, this isn't working. No! I'm running out of stamina! Oh my gosh. There we go, finally. Jeez. <laughs> you are dead. What is that sound? Is the dragon nearby? Congratulations. On what? I knew it. Nope, nope, nope. What is he doing? There we go. Can I leave a note here? There we go. Turn back and go left. This. I can't do anything there. Maybe it means this way. Aaron, you use the souls to purchase things and to level up. They're your currency and your XP. If you die, all of the souls that you have are dropped at that spot where you died. Oh, beginners should try this area later? Okay, I'll come back. I'm glowing because I'm technically dead. Um, I have not regained my body form yet. Um, the difference is whenever you're in your soul form like this, the game is generally a little bit easier. The world is a little less hostile. But your health is not at full power. I think there are some other differences as well that it hasn't explained yet. Okay, I can't remember if I should be going this way yet. Oh, 
was that a dragon? I do not want to go on this bridge if there's a dragon here. Where'd he go? Oh, I forgot there's a photo mode in this game. Look at that. Wow. Look at that detail. That's incredible. What is that red reflection? What is that reflecting? Is that reflecting the blood right there? That's crazy. Wow. You can turn off the player. You can turn off my helmet. That <laughs> Oh, that's so funny. This photo mode is crazy. <laughs> there we go that's that's a future thumbnail right there <laughs> let's go ahead and i'm gonna post that live here i'm gonna post that on my twitter right now <laughs> Let's see, what should I title this? Human Souls is going well. Beautiful. There we go. Okay. Well, I'm bailing. Wait. <gasps> Why does the dragon keep coming back? I'm really tempted to see if I can get across, but I think I'm gonna I'm gonna resist. If I remember correctly, there. Uh, I think there were some areas that I didn't go through the fog. Let's go back to the next. Wait, relinquish all souls. No, 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 no. Okay, I think I have to go back to the archstone, I believe, to get back to the nexus with my souls intact. So let's backtrack here a little bit and go back to that opening area. Oh, wait, I never went down here, did I? No, I did not. Nope, nope. There we go. 
Chris, thank you very much for the like and the share and the hundred stars. I appreciate it. I'm feeling quite well. Doing pretty good, pretty good. Loving Demon Soul so far. Ask me any question you could possibly desire. That's what you went on the wheel spin. Aw, oh, man, come on, come on. Time for slashing, okay? Is there something hidden around here somewhere? I just did 10 push-ups, Chris. Like, probably less less than five minutes ago. On Aaron's wheel spin. Ooh. Oh, we got a blue face guy down there. Well, you don't believe me? You really don't believe me, Chris? Wow. Wow. Okay. All right. All right. Cool. Good to know. Okay. That's a very informative exchange right there. Thank you. I'm not even scared of you. Come on, bro. Okay, that's a three swing. Okay. Noted. Noted. Oh my god. Okay. someone donates at least a hundred stars um, I spin a wheel and whenever I spin that wheel one of the possible results on the wheel is me doing 10 push-ups oh boy I love this game this is the whole reason I bought a ps3 back in college Okay, I don't- did I open this? Is that what that thing did? No. I need to get my souls back. I think I know where I was at, roughly. Stab attack. Oh, Jesus. Making good progress here. I did not open this door. No, that one's still closed. Um, I have not opened this one yet, right? Yeah, fire is good against the phalanx. I remember that. But I have opened this one, so I've got this shortcut. Wait, did... Oh. Oh, 
Oh my god. There are so many barrels. Nope, stay away from me. I like how it caught the corpse on fire. That was a nice little detail. Okay, now the question is... Where is the path to where I was going before. I can't remember. There's that blue faced guy right here. No problem. Got a sharpening stone. Oh yeah, right, okay. I'm getting close now to where I died. Nope. Almost back. Worked out very well. Okay, that's the merchant down there. Um, nothing here. I know there's a bunch of enemies over this way. It was right down there is where I died, right past that area. Okay, so let's go up there and deal with the archers first. So they're not pestering me. Oh, dang it. guy how are you doing tonight Chris what have you been up to are you playing anything in particular these days back down here and grab where my souls were at. I've gained almost a thousand just getting back to them, which is pretty awesome.
<laughs> okay. souls at where are my souls at they were right here weren't they oh yeah here they are right yeah nice okay now let's try to take this guy on again I'm feeling more confident now that I kind of know the way his attacks work he has that three swing combo okay that's a charge that's a one hit that's a charge There we go. That was nothing. There are seven enemies ahead. Oh, my God. I don't know how I feel about that. Can I jump over this? No. Okay, how did this guy die? Oh, there's enemies coming. Yep. I could have sworn I clicked attack, but whatever. Ooh, a scimitar, huh? Um, Eighty is pretty good. I don't remember what all these stats mean. What all those icons are. I wish there was some type of key of some kind. That's a lot of enemies. Come back to that guy. Some more souls there. Try fire. Oh, good idea. How do I even equip a firebomb? Oh, that's glorious. 
There we go. We'll just have to do that on the in that other room. I totally forgot I, I had fire bombs. It's weird. There's not a more efficient way to use them. They're not include. Oh, you can put them on this. Duh. There we go. So what's everyone thinking of this game so far? If you've been watching. Very useful. Okay, I think I know what to do up here then. actually worked out pretty well yo Tim what's up over on YouTube yeah I played the one on ps3 as well I, d I never finished it but this uh, I mean this game is just blowing my mind it looks visually it is so amazing oh come on this game's not that hard this is only the first level my thanks for your brave rescue. I am a Strava of Boletaria. Accept this as a token of my gratitude. A brass telescope? Is what he gives me? Really? Yeah, seeing this in 4K is definitely a game changer. I mean, as cliche as that sounds. Oh, well, if you were trying to do PvP, then yeah. This game is pretty brutal. Oh, you haven't found a PS5 yet in Belgium? Hopefully you can get one. I don't often recommend consoles at launch, but I recommend the PS5 for sure. Now I take my leave. There's something that he must do. I can't remember if it's worth following him. I'm kind. Of, I'm tempted to kill the guy just to get his weapons, but you would probably be able to beat me. Okay, I think I'm gonna head back to the Nexus or I don't know because I don't want to have to go through all this stuff again I'm just not entirely sure where to go especially since there's no map I feel like was there a fog gate at the top of some stairs that I never went into. Up here, maybe? I feel like there might have been. This is the quest line I'm supposed to protect him. Really? I don't remember that. Where did he go? Am I just supposed to follow him around?
Where the hell did he go? Where on earth did that guy go? It's not like there's a lot of exits. Like where, where could he have gone? I need to kill all enemies without him dying. Are you talking about this is like for a hundred percent completion? That's what I need to do or just in general because I'm not really the type of person that cares too much about completion percentages. Oh, he's in the Nexus now. Okay. Okay, so I don't need to do anything else with him. Okay. I thought you meant I needed to follow him around and protect him. Got it. Yeah, sorry I missed your message, Chris. Yeah, I would recommend giving it a shot again. I can't really speak to the Dark Souls games. I've never really gotten into those very much, but this one, I feel like in some ways it's more difficult, but in other ways it's more accessible. It's kind of more linear. Like, it, it just makes it's a little easier to progress through in terms of, like, knowing where to go and what to do. Okay, do I need to go back down this way again? I don't want to have to go back down here again. This area was so annoying. Uh, wait. Oh, I forgot. I should have just done that the first time. I fought my way down this path last time, and it took forever. Oh hey, this is my message right here. Hey Chris, thank you for the 100 stars over on Facebook. Let me give you your wheel spin. Then again. Ask me anything. <laughs> you got that again. Oh my god. Okay, so am I supposed to go across the bridge that has the dragon on it? Oh, I know, right, Chris? The Call of Duty fanboys are not a big fan of my zombies review for Cold War. Even though I gave it a 7. Oh my god. That's amazing. There's not really anything to talk about. I deleted most of the messages. It was just a lot of vulgarity. Whoa. Hang on. Let me face towards it more. 
Let's see what, what, what kind of pose. <laughs> I can't wait for the dragons. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. <laughs> that's pretty great. Okay. So if I remember correctly, there's a way to get the dragon to kill everyone on that bridge without hitting you but I can't remember what it is you do maybe you do I charge out there and then come back to trigger the dragon I think that might be what it is yeah let's see oh my god oh boy Coming back already. I really, I'm, I'm terrified of this dragon right now. I've got almost three thousand souls. Yeah, okay, here he is. Is he gonna kill him? Where'd the sound go? That sucks that it bugged out. Nope, nope, nope. He's doing another run. Okay. That went farther than, <laughs> than I thought it would. Oh my god. Okay, let's try that again. I think I need... To, can I just make a run for it? Hang on. Oh, nope, 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 nope. I have to get a screen... I have to get a photo of the of the fire right behind me. Hey, what's up, Jimster? incredible this might be the greatest image that I've ever had the privilege of attempting to take hang on oh, there we go get the field of view out more oh man <laughs> hey don't worry about what's gonna happen after photo mode's done okay let's Let's just focus on uh, the cool, the cool photo here. Whoa! You can turn on a filter and then use it while you're in game. That's crazy. Brightness. You can adjust all that color balance. Man. Oh, you have your PS5 now, Jimster? That's awesome. Have you played anything on it yet? Oh, here we go. <laughs> Expression. That's perfect. <laughs> Hang on. Let's. I think that's as terrified as it gets. <laughs> oh, 
Oh wow, hang on. Oh, that's kind of amazing right there. Oh, I like that. That's a good shot. Yeah, that works too. There we go. <laughs> Is that afraid? Is that as far as it goes? delete that one you guys are just gonna watch me post this on Twitter right now that's what's happening earlier I tweeted that demon souls is going well and I say never mind perfect yeah, the photo mode is pretty incredible. Okay, you guys ready to see what happens? <laughs> oh. It honestly didn't take away very much health, all things considered here. Actually, I might have been able to make it. If I go full speed. Oh my god. I made it, sort of. I don't think I can get any riskier than that, Aaron. I'm sorry. I could give you a few screenshots there, Chris. I <laughs> barely made it. Yep, that's right. Ooh. Oh, here we go. That's the first boss, right there. I remember fighting this thing. Oh boy. Don't forget to use the lever. Very good advice.
Beware of enemies, thank you. Alright, I'll see you around, Chris. Thank you for stopping by, as always. Nice. Enjoying all the hidden treasures here. Oh, that guy's a mage. He's trying to... Nope. That didn't work well. Okay. Oh. How's he attacking through the wall? Come on. It's a bunch of garbage. Is there someone else in here? I can't tell. No, I guess not. I've got so many souls right now, I am freaking out. Look forward to miracles. Whew, all right. I'm loving this two-handed sword, though. This might be my preferred... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. I'm not a fan of that thing. said to use fire, if I remember correctly. Yeah, fire seemed to do a lot of damage. It's a cool shield. What is that down there? Looks gooey. Yeah, that's another one of these things. Anything else here? I think I'm clear. <laughs> I'm proud of you. That's nice. All right. Well, now it's time to go back. Go back to the Nexus. Whoa, that was the first time I, I ever had any frame drops. That's surprising. The Nexus.
only six followers away from 1,300 here on Facebook. Filthy. <laughs> Trash, throw it out. <laughs> and his have spent a look at what has become of us now. I refuse to believe that this is what Father wished for our great land. Okay, that's that knight guy that I rescued. Um, what does this do? Can I talk to that now? There's a lot of tips over here. Holy crap. Hey Tim, thank you for subscribing on YouTube. I forgot to update that alert, I'm sorry. It's the default one still. So. Oh wait, these are all developer tips. You have the chance to, yeah, to repost after a parry. Your weapon will be useless without the necessary stats. Wow, that is so gorgeous. Oh, we have a, there's another merchant here. Oh How has this happened? Has God abandoned us for King of that? Oh, Ambassador. Well, she's not a real merchant. I forgot how much I love the messages in this game. Some of the ones people leave are so funny. Society. Okay, I think it is time for me to actually use my souls. Demon souls. Okay, I... I believe I gave this guy some. You have a heart of gold. Oh, good. I can afford to wait. Yeah, let's repair my equipment. Um, I could upgrade my bastard sword. Uh, you just press you press on the touchpad and you go to write message right here. You can um, start with the template. They have different formats for it here. And then those star uh, words, the ones that are blurred out, those are so like let's say let's say like turn back and go and then I can pick a word to fill in there. It's a pretty flexible system. You can be really creative with it. I can afford to weapons. Let's see. Anything good? Ooh, a battle axe. That only does 80 though. A heater shield. Doesn't really seem like he has very much good stuff. I think it'd be better off just upgrading what I already have. Ooh, yes. Oh, I've only got three. I need four total. Okay. okay well, what about the longsword? That would make it do almost as much damage. And I do have enough for that one. Plus, I could have a shield at the same time. I think I'm going to go that route. I've now got a longsword plus one. You come back alive. I need your business. 
Hello again. I'm, I'm keeping it close. I'll put all of these in storage. Don't need that. I'll put the all of those in storage. I don't need these things. You have a heart of gold. Let's go back to the long sword now. Get my kite shield out. There we go. Cool. Hello again. I'm keeping it close. You have a heart of gold. Don't let me take it from Before we end the stream, I'm gonna go try to fight that boss. That'll be the last thing I try to do. Instant load times are still just so crazy to me. to parry. I couldn't get it to work out. I've defeated over 9,000 demons. Almost time for the boss here. Nice, another firebomb. And we'll get rid of this guy too. Okay. <clears throat> Alright everybody, wish me luck here. It's time. I'm gonna have my fire bombs ready. Very happy to switch back to my shield for this fight. This is a pretty simple fight, it seems like. You just gotta be patient.
Yeah, this is like the world's slowest game boss for sure. I can guarantee you most of the bosses in this game are not like this. It takes forever to switch to the one that you want to target. Oops. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, it's getting faster though. The fewer of them there are, the faster it gets. That makes sense. Let's take out these stragglers. Yeah, I bet them salt would do wonders. This thing's very slug like. That was my last firebomb. Yeah, I've been healing this whole time off and on. Oh, now I got my body back. But your health, your total amount of potential max health is limited when you're not in your body form. But when you're in your body form, you can get invaded by enemy players as well. Yeah, that was a very easy boss. It's very, very easy. Most of the bosses in this game are not like that at all. Look at the toes. Alright, let's go level up. The 
monumental will explain the nexus to thee. Oh, there you go, Jimster. That's how you compliment a guy. Thank you for that. I think if I talk to her, that's how I can level up. The monument, the monument. If the monumental awaits the above. Okay, I have to go talk to this thing first. Is that what she's referring to? Is this what I'm supposed to do? That's my current profile. I don't know if going all the way up here is actually what I'm supposed to do or not. Ooh. That lunge is not a good choice. Yeah. That's pretty clear. Ooh, that music is nice. Okay. There's an item down here. We have long Oh, uh, cutscene time, right? In the distant past, under benevolent rule, the world was united owing to the soul art. Until a lust for power caused the awakening of the old one. Across the land seeped a colorless, deep fog, and the world faced extinction at the hands of the demons. Thanks be, we were able to lull the old one back to its slumber. Yet only after the loss of innumerable souls. And most of the world, lost, erased by the fog. In order to mend the fabric of what lands still remained, we entrusted six leaders with six precious archstones. One to the king of a small yet industrious land. One to the king of the burrowers underground. One to the wise queen of the great ivory tower. One to the chieftain of lost and ill-fortuned souls. One to the shaman of the tempest worshipping shadowmen. And the last to the great giants of the northern lands. The archstones were placed in the fringe lands that survived. We contained the old one here below the nexus and prohibited the soul arts. Finally, we became monumentals, half living sentinels of the fabric of reality. Alas, the other monumentals have perished, and only I remain. Why are they like little kids? I don't get that.
The four sealed arch zones have been unlocked. Okay, so I can go to any now world now. It is your turn. You must lull the old one back to its slumber and seal it away for all eternity. If not, a deep fog will absorb all that we know. Have you the strength to bear this burden? Except, what if I say no? Oh, Gemster. Yes. I think this... I think this is the best looking video game I've ever played. Like, easily. Now, go forth and destroy every last demon. The old one, without demons to feed its soul, will a new servant seek and lure you to its bosom. Now, the tricky thing is, when it comes to leveling up, I'm not sure what the ideal what have I got? build is exactly that I should be going for for melee. Krasla, thank you very much for the like on Facebook. I appreciate it. That is a very long ways down. See, I don't want to mess up my character because I can't remember if you can respec or not. So I'm going to have to be careful. Should you lose your physical form, remember the eye stone. Maiden in black manipulates souls. Allows her to aid slayers of demons. What is it? Seek us down the power of souls? Of course. After all, God, let these vagabond souls become thine own. Okay, seek soul power. Here we go. So, I can't remember... Let me do a quick little... I don't know. We're just gonna... We're gonna just guess here. Having more health sounds nice. But then again... My equipment burden... Getting that lower would be nice. I could also change my armor to do that well. Tim, thank you, thank you. Strength or dexterity? I'm thinking strength probably makes more sense because I, I think I like using two-handed. Health and endurance. Maybe put like... I can put four. You know what? Let me... I'm going to have a lot more to work with than what I actually have right now. Okay, so that's a storage. Well, I don't know actually. I was thinking I like using two handed, but I like having a shield, so it's kind of hard to say. Maybe I will go dexterity. 
is how do you how can you tell um, what type of weapon or what type of set a weapon uses? Yeah, I'm, I'm just not interested in using magic, to be honest with you. Okay, so I have the long sword. I do not understand how to check the scaling of a weapon. Um, I've got the Bastard Sword. I like that one. The Scimitar. Let's see. So Bastard Sword, my strength wasn't high enough to use that one-handed. And I think, if I remember correctly, the Scimitar is a dexterity weapon. But I just don't know how... To re oh, there we go. Ah, that's much more useful. Okay. I'm still not sure. Okay, so it requires eight strength and ten dexterity. Yeah, at the bottom you see A, B, C, D, and E. That's right. Requires 18 strength to use that one effectively. Okay, I see. So a, dex so a scimitar scales better with dexterity. Obviously. Whereas the longsword and bastard sword scale better with strength. Okay. Oh, dude, I've heard Valhalla's like 90 plus hours long, which is ridiculous. I think may maybe I'll end up going strength. So that way I have a little more flexibility with the with the weapons, I guess, a little bit more. Okay, let's... Let's use up all of our souls here. Okay. I'll knock that up. Get that. Get our dexterity up. Or endurance up, I mean. Yeah, I think shield and weapon's probably what I'm going to do. So, I'll get 18 strength. That, look, that looks pretty good. Yeah, I can totally see that angle of a gemster. I wish. Art thou finished? May thy strength help I guess, Tim, is there a way to respec your build? Is that something you can do in this? Looks like I have quite a bit more health now, which is nice. Does he have new things? Your souls. Ooh, I can upgrade that even further. Now, leveling up isn't that complicated, Aaron. All, all it is is you, you collect souls, and then you spend the souls to level up whichever stat you want. So the stats all... I mean, it tells you on the on the right side exactly what, what gets impacted by leveling up something. So for me, I was just trying to plan ahead and figure out what would fit the type of character I want to play the best, but you can easily just kind of level up and go 
you know, by the seat of your pants more. Maybe at the statue. No interesting. Oh, this statue over here. You have an offering of 25,000 souls. I don't know what that does. Whoa. That is so cool. And remind me if, if uh, am I mistaken, Tim, is um, whenever I'm in my human body, does that mean that I can get invaded by players? Is that the main difference? Can we only spend our souls? I don't know what you're asking. W was there supposed to be something else after that in the message, Shimser? You can use souls to buy items, to buy, um, to level up, etc. There we go, I've got nine souls left. I used them all up. And you can only invade in soul form. Gotcha, gotcha. Uh, okay, send phantoms home or return to own world. This is where you can leave the soul sign to help others. Is there a way to intentionally play co-op with someone? Or is it all purely like by chance, essentially? Okay, why can't I equip these other things here? <clears throat> oh, and my other, one of my other questions is, can I do anything with my items after I'm done? Like, if I decide that I don't want to use a certain sword, like, can I, do I need to just keep holding on to it or is there a benefit? Like, can I salvage it or sell it or something, or...? You have a heart I can't remember. Don't let them take it from you. I wonder, should I upgrade my shield or my sword? Okay, so you just have to stick all your old items in storage, basically? Oh, I don't have any any souls left to upgrade. My bad. No interest, eh? Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Well, uh, thank you for all the tips and advice, Tim. I appreciate it. Thank you for subscribing over on YouTube. Guess I'll keep the bastard sword. Actually, no. Okay, all these extra items here. I don't need that with me, right? Cool. <laughs> All right, cool. Well, uh, thank you everyone for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed watching some Demon Souls on PS5. This is my uh, first impressions of the game, going through the first zone, uh, being the first boss, all that good stuff. Um, so thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, yes, good night, everybody. Thank you for stopping by. I'll be live again tomorrow with uh, something retro. I haven't decided what yet. Uh, but yeah, thank you everybody for tuning in. Thank you, uh, Facebook, Twitter, and or Facebook, Twitch, and YouTube. I will be back again tomorrow, like I said. Uh, hello, Bell. You tuned in just in time to say goodbye. So, uh, bye everybody. Have a good night, and I'll see you again next time.